iOS 13.6 developer beta 3 just got released and in this video we are going to look at the performance how's the battery life on iPhone 7 and do we see any kind of performance bump so this update came along with iPad OS 13.6 beta 3 and Mac OS 10.15.6 beta 3 so in this video we are going to look at the actual performance on iPhone 7 do we see any kind of bugs and all that stuff now taking a look at performance here I came from iOS 13.5.1 to 13.6 developer beta and I don't really feel a performance bump here. It's okay, it feels snappy, I haven't even encountered a single bug but I really don't see a major performance bump here from iOS 13.5.1. So talking about the size of this update. So as I told you, I came from 13.5.1 to 13.6 beta 3. Uh, the size were, for me was nearly 3 gigs but if you come from iOS 13.6.2 to beta 3 the size for you will be around 200 megabytes. Taking a look at the new features added by Apple and there's one and only new feature and that is under software update section and now you have an option to customize automatic updates and that is really great. Now the battery life. So if you go to battery section and you can see there's slight improvement in battery life so this here is ios 13.5.1 and this here is ios 13.6 beta 3 so i'm really impressed by battery life and i see a minor bump in battery now the competition comes in ios 14 versus ios 13.6 beta 3 on this iphone 7 i updated this iphone 7 to ios 14 and my experience was horrible the battery life was so much bad like I use this iPhone for like an hour and the battery is completely dead but whereas on iOS 13.6 the battery is amazing like the performance is great the battery is amazing it feels stable and all that stuff it really makes the experience so good but if you're looking for something like performance and the new features and beauty you should definitely update do remember that the battery life is not good on ios 14 so that's why i downgraded to ios 13.5.1 and now i'm on ios 13.6 beta 3 and the experience of ios 13.6 beta 3 is definitely amazing so now talking about the overall performance I love this update, it's very stable, it's fast, it's snappy and you should definitely update to iOS 13.6 beta 3. If you don't have a developer account, just wait until it comes in or you can go to iOS beta profiles.com i'll link it in the description below you can get a profile from here and you're good to go if you want a greater battery life you should definitely update to ios 13.6 it's overall stable it's amazing it feels snappy and everything's so good if you want this wallpaper i'll link it down in the description below so you can get it so if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet just hit that subscribe button i really appreciate that every subscribe means a lot to me and thanks for watching this video i'll see you guys in the next one